just asking the question, where are you all? Yeah, me too. That's a really hard... Uh, that's that's a, a matchup that Stephen May doesn't like at all, to be on a good size player like Hoskin A. He likes the bigger gorilla type box and he can stand there and actually out here. They kick towards that line number three. Colin will pass around in four and a half days in the third half. There is some serious energy inside the MCG today. Maynard's penetrating kick. From the side, Hoskin Elliott, Salem underneath. Knocked out of his hand, Schultz the same. Roof of Stadium, Berlin. Okay. Just to expand on the reason why Hoskin Elliott is really troubling for Stephen Mays. Mays, he wants to set up as his anchor defender, command and direct. Hoskin Elliott's speed and his ability to be jump is just caught. Heading for a showdown. Two teams who thrive on pressure and performing on the big occasion. Now they get their way. Where the drama is about to be played out over the next 90 intriguing minutes. Who will prevail? There's no sponsor on the remaining on the remaining um jersey at all. What is it, bro? There's no sponsor on the remaining jersey. There's no jersey. There's no, there's no there's no sponsor on the on the remaining shirt. What's Jay's sponsor? Oh Romania, yeah yeah. I think in real life they would have um, sponsorship. Yeah. Maybe their sponsorship's not popular. It's not Nike, Adidas, Puma. Yeah, maybe. New yeah. Balance. That's why it's a smaller, smaller country. So, where's up, guys? One of in here. And today I'll be bringing you guys another um, different sort of video for you guys. I'm continuing the Yoshi Euro journey with Netherlands. I don't know why I decided to pick Netherlands, I just decided why not. Because I know people from Netherlands. That's why I picked that team. And all that n nation has to say. And yeah, um, hope you guys are enjoying the Yoshi Euro so far. Um, I haven't actually got to watch any of those games. Yeah, one sec. That door's that door's not closed. Anyway, um, if you guys do enjoy this video, make sure you like and enjoy, it, subscribe if you're new, all the good stuff. I know many guys have tuned out the videos I've not been watching recently. So, yeah, um, I do appreciate if you guys come to I go on my channel and watch my videos. Because it means a lot, but um, yeah, I have been losing subscribers ever so slowly. So I'm still on 750 as we as it stands today, but that could change. We could be gaining subscribers or losing subscribers any final, any time. So yeah, yeah, I do appreciate you guys hanging around and being patient with all that stuff because you know, you having that up every day. Right like now. I said, I've been had things all good the week. I've, I've had a chance to upload here and there still. But yeah, I do appreciate the support and oh, the videos, by the way, guys. Oh. Even coming out to watch the live streams, it means a lot. And yeah, you guys in the party, I see you guys. Always watch my videos. Yeah, you know, right. enjoying uh, them. So yeah, um, yeah, I've been quite busy with these one? past few weeks, so I do appreciate it. You, you guys' patience, as always. And yeah. I had a bit of a bit of a bit of a wait one last night, right. so that's obviously why you guys didn't see a video yesterday. Because I was out, I, I, I first I first went to soccer about ten fifteen, and I got there ten thirty and played some soccer, and then after that I got a haircut. So as you guys can see, if I take the headset off. That's my haircut. So you got I got a haircut, so looking a bit fresh at the moment. And and then I went to a birthday party, um, and that was that was pretty cool. If you're just wondering how it went, it was pretty nice, pretty nice night. Stay up pretty late, but it was pretty good while we were at it. So yeah, had plenty of drinks, had some, had plenty of food. So yeah, anyway, 
that was that was something that, that was something at least, but now I'm back to normal uploads as of today. So yeah, I was trying my best guys, but I can't always be free to do videos every day. As I said before, I've got things I'm doing all week I had to have to do and stuff, so I do appreciate you guys' patience as always. And yeah. Oh, like I said, it's nothing really much I can do about what I've gone during the week, you know. I could be busy with Tay for busy with other stuff, goal. you know. You're winning, bro. Um, yeah, I'm winning, yeah. Yeah, so I think I said very much for waiting for new uploads and stuff. And even if this I'll read up on one of my old videos, like, I do Kiefer, appreciate Kiefer, you guys watching it anyway, because, you know, there's nothing else for me to post, really. Was it deflection? Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking about doing. I'm thinking about coming back to Twitch as well and doing a few Twitch streams. So, so keep an eye, keep an eye out for those guys. Yeah. Your Twitch notifications. If you follow me on Twitch, if you have Twitch is and I'll definitely try and post the Twitch streams to YouTube again, like I always do. So keep an eye out for those Twitch vods on YouTube. I don't know if I'm still going to post on this on, the, on this channel or I'm going to post them on my second channel or something. I don't know if I'm permanently moving on to the second channel yet. Because I don't, I don't know what to do on my second channel yet. It's not really much to really do on that channel, apart from doing the road to Gory, which I'm being very inconsistent with. So, don't know why I'll be coming back and doing that road to Gory, but after after find out if there's much time left to do <laughs> the road to Gory, because you know it's not very, not a very consistent series yeah. of road to Gory. So, yeah. Um, I feel I'll just be sticking to do Korean mode for now, and then maybe a bit of um, Ultra Team content if I have time. Where's the final being played? And yeah. In anyway, Olympic, um, Olympic, enjoy this video, guys. I know I've been chatting about okay. these past few videos, informing you guys of doing something a bit different. But yeah, I do appreciate the support and the on the we are doing Korean mode, the Creative Club Korean series I've started up. And if you guys continue to um, show your support on those, I would really much appreciate it. And yeah, without further ado, guys, I'll see you guys the outro. And enjoy the rest of the video. Peace. I'm winning 3 0 at now, right now. 12 minutes in, I'm winning 3 0. Very quick thinking. All oh, right. The five. It's with Cop Mainers. And that'll be offside. I'm winning 3 0. And it's bro, bro, in half time. Let, um, I've got to ask you something. Do you have FIFA 23? We should verse each other one day. Yeah, but I have to pass. I, I I was playing the PS5 version, so I do have the PS4 disc, but I haven't played like ages, so. Yeah, yeah, we just plug, put it in the disc, and, and we can play each other one Why minute. Why do you want to verse in Fear 23? Because that's where I've versed Ben today. Uh, you want to play uh, one day? Uh, yeah, if you want to. I mean, uh, I still, I, I, I still got to... I still wait till the the game stalls though, so. Yeah, that takes time. Don't worry. No Gonna way. let you go. No one's who's nice. I gotta let you go. Gonna let you go. No one's who's nice. Oh my God! Haven't scored. Oh my God. Oh. Jesus. I'm so lucky right now.
Are you talking now, Jim? Yeah, I'm here, man. I can hear you better. I can hear you better now. I just had to turn on the mic. How come your mic yeah. was down? I don't know. Just was. Well, it was before. Belgium are 3 1 against Italy. Up against Italy right now. Okay. It's half time and I'm 3 I'm free and up against Romania. <laughs> I let you go. Gonna let you go. Oh, sleepless nights. Gonna let you go. Are you listening to music and playing a game? Yeah. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Yeah, right, here we go, second half. Hey, where do you charge your phone? In your bedroom or you charge it in the lounge room? In the lounge room, yeah. Let's ask him, bro. Um, you should think about getting a portable charger, bro. You, you know the one I'm talking about, the power bank? Oh, uh, really? Yeah, oh, I got mine at Preston Market, a cheap one, it does the job. Let me know if you want one, I can take you to that shop. On High Street. Uh, okay. Only if you need it, only if you want and need. It's good if you go out and you don't have a charger with you and your phone's low battery. Missing shots with left foot, taking on players. Alright, yeah. right, right. I'm good, I'm good, I'm winning, but I'm just. Could be more up, but. I just like to win a lot. There we go, half time. Lando! Yeah? So who's winning A Phil, bro? Um, Conwood, yeah. How many points? Is it close one? It's 39 to 18, so it's, it's, it's about to be half time. Oh, it's about to be half time? Yeah. Yeah, I hear the siren. Yeah, it's it's uh, so the one I think one of the fours has a goal kick on has a kick for goal it's kicking for goal on the siren. Who Melbourne or Collingwood? Collingwood. Yeah, Collingwood should be able to win Melbourne, I think. Yeah. I think Melbourne got injuries or something. Like that. Oh, man, it's All right, four nil. Let's go. Let's four nil. Let's go. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way Glide passed the defender to create space for himself. But there's still plenty for him to do. Under all sorts of pressure from the defender, he's just able to keep him at bay and finishes with a flop. It's a great goal. And this 
is turning into something of a rout. Four nil. minutes to go in this one. The Netherlands recovering possession well. And he has options available. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Jeremy Frimpong. And a tidy tackle. Ben Gatti, but we love what he's doing. You can't expect him... Marie. Well, the shot more than decent. It had power. Just couldn't find the target. They decided that now is the time to come out with a point. Well, they've got to be careful here. They've got to be careful. 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 They've got
in the final. That's pretty good. Pretty cool, man. BB Stadium Dortmund. Uh, I, guess this, I guess this is Dortmund Stadium we're playing at now. So here we go guys, we're in the semi-finals of playing Belgium, and here we go, let's play, play match. Well, we, so if we win this, we get to the final, we play either, um, we play whoever wins the other semi-final. <laughs> I think it was Ukraine or Croatia, so they're playing off in the other semi-finals. Hey, um, Jim, when I finish this Euro tournament, do you want to verse in um the online friendly section on the PS4 version? You no, know, it has the online friendly section in, in um Euro 2024. Hey, can you we repeat that, brother? I said, I said, when, when you hop back on PlayStation, we'll, we'll verse on the online families thing on Euro 2024. Sweet, yeah, I'm down for that. That's after I finish this tournament. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I'm one new up already. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, I see that. Turn it up. Let's go, Lando. Let's go. Yeah. Uh, have you been playing on Switch lately? Or? Uh, not really, no. Uh -huh. 
That's a perfect challenge. Trying to open them up. And here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. Three goals without reply. Up to a tear. Tielemans. They can counter from here. Another oh, example of a counter attack that went nowhere. The play there. Great grab hold of it. Not a time for composure on the ball. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Well, I dare say, sometimes as the free kick taker, you wish the cameras weren't rolling. Yeah, no wonder he looks embarrassed. He's way off target with that one. Jack Paul. No time to challenge magnificently. But he's certainly not alone. A gift for any goalkeeper. Or goalkeeper mistake, will there be a price to pay? to Belgium then. That's the challenge that was required. The Bruyne. He fancies it. And the keeper more than equal to it. Keen to take it short here. Damn it. two things wrong defensively about this first of all the goalkeeper should not be parrying it into a dangerous area and the defenders have to be sharp to get to the knockdown it's, it's not good defending all round it's Eric's he uses a team of a few passes four goals on this match now three one it is but have you tried view electricity pricing zoning and data on any house even if it's not valued a foul but advantage play <laughs> Jeremy Frimpong. Until they mean business on this occasion. Well, nothing comes of it. It looks promising. If you want to do something different, even if we don't know what... Tielemans. Oh, nice ball. Well, oh, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Open Universities Australia. Crucial intervention inside the box. Tielemans. Wonderful challenge. And a throw in coming up. Oh, the Netherlands haven't had that much of the ball so far. But their counter attacking has been really good, particularly in the wide areas. It's been an excellent performance from them so far. And having to soak up a bit of pressure again here. 
Wow, okay. Well, I guess they're coming back. <laughs> Oh, Bobby's on one. Yeah? Uh, Carlos Alcaraz won. Well, this is worth um, watching again. Just look tenet. how easily the pie goes past his man. And what a clinical finish. Who, who won? Carlos Alcaraz. Not much chance for the keeper there. Alcaraz won the, sh won the French Open. Yeah, that's right, buddy. Yeah. Okay. Clearance it was. Back terrific. Well, 
and cutting it out. Well, they might be able to launch a counter attack. Well, they have to pay attention. Oh, big opportunity! As always, likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Now, room to roam on the wing for Belgium. And they dealt with the threat first. Where are we? Winning? Yeah, I'm winning. Yeah. Winning, right? Yeah, Belgium. Yeah. Counter clinically. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Well, maybe I wrote him off too quickly. Good defending in the end. Got a red to win possession back. He's in here. Talk soon. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna have dinner, early dinner today. Okay. Full right. Left for play. There's a deep wide kick against the pocket. The foul? Exactly well, the fans want to see a shot. Pivotal moment defensively. What have they got left in a moment now? Because now they're most grateful on the game. It's down by three points. What are they going to show us for this next part of the game? Amazing. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Last two after Melbourne had a very hopeful start to the 
this game pull up on this camera and was able to get that clean work in back in Oops, so key. Right. Promising sequence. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Side bottom. And over the byline, goal kick coming up. This is going to be a double substitution. There is Billings, the sub. Keep back inside for the skin. Mickey van der Ven. Malin with it. Throws Electing to shoot. Save but still a chance. It's a perfect challenge. Being pressed and pressed high. Up Chance here. Foiled by Van Dyke. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is. Tapped it straight to Nick Dacos, who sharked it to McRae. And McRae kicks the pies back to the wing. McDonald too heavy in the body contact. Too early. Free kick to Kruger. Chance Mark Elite. No one stood like Dacos. Now shorts. And ends with Kruger anyway. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. Not just his goal, but his all round play. He was excellent. They're having a lot of fun down there. Oliver at the cold face kicks smothered. And Roy reaches up to him. Well, going to Laurie. His deep kick over the top worked out. Turner told to go. Back to Laurie. He'll be closed down by side bottom. He broke the tackle. Bailey Laurie. Kick favours Dean. You can look at that picture of the coaches and they're enjoying themselves in the boundary, but McLean would say that's about enjoying the moment. Yeah. It's not about, about being smart and disrespectful, it's just about enjoying each moment as it happens and allowing the players the freedom to do that. Here is McDonald, should easily outdo Shorts, and he does here. Just looking at the crowd here at the moment, as McDonald goes forward and very wide to Fritch, Fritch will take the mark, Pickett's in the pocket, and he'll get hold of this, and he does. So now this one's a long way out to kick it around the corner here. He'd do well. He needs to get the height around the corner here. A long way out to do it. There he goes. Got the height. And it gets there. Curls around the post magnificently. So Pickett brings it back to a margin of 27 points. Very classy goal from Kasaya Pickett. Just gonna say about the crowd as we see the work of Pickett there. Now look at that a magnificent round the corner. If it's north of eighty four thousand today, which I think it will be. Um yeah, so we're finally in the final of the um of the Euro twenty twenty four and the reason why I've got the quarter final and semi final in the same video is so when I do the next video, the final will be a separate video. So if that makes sense.
but anyway, this is basically that's basically the bracket for the knockouts and stages and stuff. So basically, we got through. We beat Romania. We beat um. So we beat Turkey, and then Romania, and then Belgium, and now we're versus Ukraine. <laughs> so <laughs> it's been a bit of a journey to get to the final of the UEFA Euro 2024. Of course, this is in real life. Of course, I don't actually know who's going to win in real life. It's just a uh, it's just a uh, like FIFA ESC simulated tournament, so even have a really in real life. We don't, we'll have to find out who wins in real life, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and please like, and enjoy, subscribe, and you, and yeah, stay tuned for the next installment of the Euro for Euro 2024, the last episode, the, the fourth and final episode, which is the final, and yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.